Well, I'm a rice alum, Sid Rich 04. I actually came to do an event with the Rice Vegan Society, and I met one of uh, Dr. Gilberson's uh, TAs. His name is Jordan. Jennifer started her own business doing healthy vegan baking. Her business is called Awesome Bites, and so she had this problem where she's trying to make this new kind of plant-based milk. She's making a coconut flaxseed milk. She's like, I love what you're doing. He's like, do you think you have something that um, our honors chemistry lab could work on? The problem is when she's making it, it separates out into layers. So she wants to figure out how can she keep it homogenous for a much longer shelf life. I went to Jordan and I said, do you think you know they could work on that? And he was like, oh, that's going to be great. <laughs> so we've been working on it for something like 10 weeks now. Every week we change something a little different because we're trying to create the most efficient and successful solution that we can. Both of our teams are talking about the, the pH of the milk, so we're trying to make it more basic and then they're trying to make it more acidic. We took out all of the sweeteners and a lot of other components and just used the coconut cream, flaxseed, and water because we knew the separation was really coming from those components. But the students spent the whole semester working with this and smelling the coconut and weren't able to taste anything because we were in a chemical laboratory where it's unsafe. And so the chance to use the Martell Kitchen and have them take their best recipe from 13 weeks of work and now add the flavorants that are added to the milk and be able to actually taste the components um, makes the experience complete for them, makes them understand that the science has real implications, but then you have to consider practical applications to the science as well. I wish we had more time to like continue experimenting because we have so many ideas that like we kind of want to try, but the semester is just about over, so it's like, I wish we could keep going, but we're having to like wrap up. I'm gonna tell you, I have a lot of friends in the food industry, everything from restaurants to, you know, consumer products, you know, and uh, they are all jealous of me right now. They're like, what? You have like a group of like 32 kids like trying to fix your like crazy weird coconut flaxseed milk? And I was like, yes, and they love it. <laughs> it looks really good. Yeah, it looks 